Hey there, either Holder Fire Familia. Welcome to another Narjan Reacts. And this we're reacting to The Legend of Vox Machina, Season 1, Episode 4. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Throw them in irons! <laughs> you heard him come <laughs> I don't think you want to mess with the grog. We did nothing wrong. Sovereign, it's been a very long evening. They're gonna so, like, if they all get thrown into jail together, they're all gonna, f like, no, they're gonna all attack Percy for Percy blaming them and stuff when they literally almost gave their lives to help him fight those two. I will see that they are properly punished. Are you going to bail them out? Do you have proof? No. But Do you have any spells or something that can test for that? You are hereby confined to your keep under house arrest. That's not too bad. All right, don't complain. That's better than just being outright put in jail or killed, okay? Let's not complain. How can you arrest a house? Okay. Thank you, Lady Laura. Briarwood side of the story. If they mm. don't speak to us anymore. Wouldn't that be a shame if they don't? They were, they're out of there. They're like, we're out. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Because uh, Percy... No, it wasn't Percy. It was uh, Vax that... Was it uh, Fox? No. I think it was Fox. I think Fox is the brother. Yeah, pretty sure he is. But he's the one that took that item. Stop. We're gonna have to go back for it. We have the means of retrieving it, don't we? What's that mean? Like, really take? Are they gonna take over? Like, um, I feel like they're gonna mind control or something. Even though I don't think they can, they seem to do it like through voice or like kind of like the eye thing, the mind control with the eyes contact. So, trinket. Oh, come on, man! It's not a weapon. I just want to serenade the group. And you're doing us a favor. <laughs> will be returned. You will be executed. Are you fucking joking? I'm sorry. I still can't get over with the series. How they're like talking so like this is like medieval and everything. And it's just like, are you fucking joking? <laughs> I do not joke. I Does this look like a joking face? Grog! What? I know trying to concentrate. Talk about, but I'm not turning into a vampire, am I? Oh, that's right. The one bit him. That's why he said we have a means to get it back. Oh, okay, so he is going to control Vax. Fox. I, I need to hear their names again to remember. Which one's which? I withdraw the question. <sighs> it's like, can you see your reflection in the mirror? You can. You're good. So what are we waiting for? Let's fuck up these guards and bust out of here. No. Oh, so you'd like to Maybe Pike has a spell that can cure him. I think cuz uh, I think cuz her amulet was broken or whatever. I don't wonder if she can even do magic anymore. Or the healing magic anymore. I, I, I don't know what she said. Screw what all she that. said. We should focus and right here in tiny letters it says oh, fuck you vax. <laughs> I remember there's something somebody would say where it's like, "Oh, it says right here none of your business." Oh, lovely. You gotta translate this. <laughs> All right, to no flip off. Can you just? I was using that. <laughs> we need to talk. All of us. Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't get pissed at Percy yet, considering. Percival. Certainly. What would you like to discuss, Vexalia? Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Yeah, so brother is Vox, she's Vax. Okay, I, I, I got it mostly right for the first time. Dad, I thought to mention that the Briarwoods killed your family. <laughs> and there goes Brock. I wasn't aware that you were owed information about my past. When your past comes to kill us, I'd say mm -hmm. we deserve a heads up. And yeah. how exactly was I to know the Briarwoods would be attended? I mean, fair. Sorry. I Did she just say I, just, I want to know about the smoke? Maybe I got carried away. Maybe they did to my family. Then why don't you tell us? Open up, tell us your feelings. Even our tutor, the man my parents entrusted with our safekeeping, betrayed us. Those don't look like faces I trust. No offense. After enduring weeks. They look like twisted versions of Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I Open that with barely any effort. You take me to the nicest place. Are they gonna summon the dead? Okay. That's not a simple "braise the dead" spell. About an old keep like this. It's quite Secret passages. Small details. 
I love the way they just peek around. With some light pickle. Pickle. Just don't explode all of them. And so are we. I was gonna say, if they've got the place surrounded, if it goes right outside, like the outside of the house, it'd have to go out, like past the house to like the forest for them to not be seen. Oh, oh, fuck a duck. Fuck a duck. I'm sorry, what? I thought I'd never hear that in a show. So, uh, at least an animated one. Your group, like children. Krog needing like four or five people. Oh. Uh, he's like, you don't need to push me in. I'll just stay in. I'll shut the door myself. Eat a fucking sandwich. And have the woman make it. There's a way to make our situation simpler. You know Does freaking Anna not know how to make a sandwich? He's just biting into that loaf of bread. No. Oh, because they took all the knives and cut it. Never mind. So he's. You didn't have to use his teeth. He could have just broken it. Guards might catch the group, but not you and me. True. We're sneakier. Could. And why aren't we? You too. What was that? Is this the Briars? Come on. She's trying to fix it. Or is that a connection? Who or what is Everlight? Grog? That's Grog. Sorry, Pikey. <laughs> Not like you couldn't hear me coming. Gotta be here. I love how when he was approaching her, it's just thump, thump, thump. But when he goes to walk outside, it's just like normal footsteps. No. Uh, kind of hard to meditate and concentrate when you're doing all this, Grog. What's this powder? Uh, Ashes. Spices? Oh my freaking god, I swear if that's ashes and he's about to- uh, Please don't. Please please just be like- I'd rather be like- I'd rather be like burnt wood or something like that. Please don't be ashes. The ashes of my ancestors? Mm. Ew. All right. Hello? This thing on? She's gonna snap at you, Grog. Maybe you should just say sorry. Just say sorry. It starts with sorry. Okay, Charlie. No, we're not having Charlie. What, are you a werewolf? Hey. The fuck was that? Did you see something? Are these? Oh, these are gonna be the undead that the Briar wife went and summoned. Vampire wife. Oh, he's dead. Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, shit. I'd be running, not standing there staring, gawking. Just you and me in here. Just you and me here alone. Flush. Nervous twiddle thumb. <laughs> Finger. But I guess none of us ever share that kind of stuff, huh? I would doubt most of you have. I may never see my family again. What? Yeah, my- You have a family? I mean, we all came from somewhere, so obviously we had a family at one point, or we still do. They or they still do. Day. But there's a world of difference between your struggle and mine. Whether you succeed or fail- Yeah, the family returns family you. Is still alive. Mm-hmm. With me, quickly. I don't think y'all are prepared for this. Where have the guards gone? Dead. Fan out. Oh yeah, trinkets out there. It was the fuss, boy. Nothing's out here. <laughs> yeah. It's not her trinket. Hi. We better warn the others. <laughs> I was expecting a creepy episode right now. I don't want to wreck your shrine. Oh, Grog. I, I think that now's not- you- you just- you literally just ate half a pot of her ancestors. I don't think it matters at this point. Just break it out so you- break the door. Grog. Do your Grog thing. Do your Grog you thing. It. Oh. Wow. It's kind of- I can lie to that. That sandwich looks pretty good. Creepy shit. Creepy shit. 
What did you do? What did we do? You didn't kill them. Who, Who did? did? We're about to find out. Uh, chancing, I guess it was them. God, this is creepy. Imagine waking up like in bed. <laughs> nope, no sleep for me. These are more than just zombies. These are like ghouls. It's the briar. That's where I figure out the briar is. Oh yeah, that's where she gets her little little jackalope. Run! Oh, she's crying. It's like I'm just a little jackalope. Leave me alone. I wonder if they need light. Ugh. I wonder. They almost seem like wraiths slash ghouls. Oh, that sucked. Oh, that sucked. Um. Matt, you got a little something in your eye and nose and... A trigger? Ew. <sighs> Ew. Really obvious lie. Obvious lie? <laughs> oh no. Before Caleb! Oh shit. Um, somebody's gonna have to do something before you all get... Whatever is happening. Why do I feel like Pike is gonna have to do something? Reestablish her connection with Everlight. Light? They need light. Yeah, they need light. Come on, Pike. You need to reestablish that connection. Say sorry. Is it gonna be Keyleth that does it? No pressure. You're all just gonna die if you don't. Boom. Oh. Ew. Pustules. Yeah, you blocked yourself in. Oh, oh, they're physical now. Bullseye. Attack them. They're physical. Stabby, stabby. <laughs> like Grog have a hand in it. He'll pulverize him. Yeah. Are you gonna smash him? Oh, I thought he was gonna smash him at the table. Whoops, he even crashed his curb stomping all this stuff. Mother Briar's gonna be disappointed. Okay, so never mind about. about the brother. I thought it was gonna be them controlling the brother, considering they bit. like he was bitten, but. okay. But I wonder if that comes in later. Don't make us fight you too. Yeah, really. It's just you alone. Give them head. Give them head. Show them the way. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. And wish me luck trying to explain all this. Yeah. What even were those? I thought they were gonna be zombies. They were like a mix of things. Look at me. I'm a snack. Sure, whatever you say. We're all with you, but no more secrets. Yeah, Percy. Understood. Hey, drink it. Hi, buddy. I'm glad it didn't go. They didn't go after oh, no, Trinket. Darling, but you'll be safer here at the keep. Oh, I have to leave Trinket. See what I mean? A snack. Very well. I mean, he is bite-sized. Huh? Poor Pike. Is not Pike gonna stay behind? I'm not going. What if I need you? Aw. You're their light now. I'll do my best. Oh, are you gonna miss her, Scanlan? <laughs> Interesting. So Pike is gonna have her own journey off on to go and reconnect with the Everlight. I'm really curious what this Everlight is. Okay, so. Chirp. Chirp. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and get into my thoughts. All right. So, hmm. That was kind of a creepy episode. Not for too long, but like that got that got dark with the. Like, I, I've already seen this series as can be gory and stuff and everything, but boy, that was so... <laughs> oh, 
That was nasty. Um, okay, so Pike's and Amber. I wonder if it's gonna bounce between the two of them, like, or we're gonna have like an episode that focuses on Pike, and then they're gonna have their own thing. So I wonder if it's gonna come first. We're we gonna focus on Pike's uh, journey, and then swap over to the team and like catch up on what they're doing, or is it gonna be kind of like a back and forth where? Uh, one episode will be on her, and next will be on them, next will be on her. Or if it's going to be, like, same time, where it's going to be balanced between the two of them in one episode. And then, like, they... I feel like at the end, though, they're... I wonder if they're going to get into a situation that then Pike... Like, after she reestablishes her connections to the Everlight, she, like... They get into a pickle or some kind of situation, and she pops back up and appears or something like that. I feel like that might happen. Um, so, they... Somebody's got to come in that translates that book. And I wonder who it would be. Hmm. And what's in that book that they want so bad? Like, why did why was the wife so panicked over the book being gone, whereas the husband didn't seem to care? But then again, he was also like, we have means to get it back. So I wonder if that's why he wasn't as stressed about it or stressed. Because he's like, we have ways to get it back. Whereas she didn't think of it at the moment. She was more emotional and stuff. So she was just like freaking out. Um, but uh, now that that's been ruined... Uh, I wonder if they're either going to have another way of getting it back or they're going to have to personally get it back. Hmm. hmm. Alright, well. Uh, the plot was good for this episode. Um, definitely creepy. Uh, feels like a Halloween episode, kind of. Um, characters were great. Uh, animation was great. Like the, the, I feel like anything in this, like, made by this studio, um, granted, it's not as fluid and stuff like it was for Korra. Like, if this is the same as you, I'm pretty sure certain it is because of the animation style and everything. Um, looking a lot like it. Uh, it doesn't feel as smooth. And I don't know if a separate studio handled that kind of animation for Korra. Because there were scenes in Korra that were very smooth. And very, like, it's like, oh, those scenes they specifically focused on and stuff. And I haven't seen anything like that in this series so far. Where there's, like, moments where an animation's, like, quality's ramped up or whatever. So I don't know if... That specific animation was handled by a different studio for Korra. And that will explain why there hasn't been anything like that yet for here. Or that or they're saving their budget for maybe more major fights or something. I don't know. The fight against the dragon. That one. I didn't, I don't, but I still didn't notice like animation like, whoa, that's a big step. Like, that's obviously higher quality or more frame rate or whatever it would be. Uh, more frames kind of thing. I don't know. Um, but yeah, like the animation is still like good. Like, I enjoy the animation from the studio. So, um. Uh, music was good, like, I, actually, yeah, I don't think I even really noticed the, anim no, there was music during, like, the, there, like, the, uh, ghoul ghost wraith things, like, it was, like, creepy ominous music, but, nothing ever set out to me in this episode for music, but still good music, um, overall, um, but, yeah, uh, those are my thoughts for this episode. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you like early access to my full and edited reactions, go join my Patreon. I'll put a link to it somewhere around here. But yeah, uh, have a wonderful morning, afternoon, night, and keep bringing bright. See ya.